So what, are you going to do the same thing as last time? Folks, again, that bright orange pull cord above your head is for medical emergencies only. Now, if you pull that cord, EMTs will be dispatched and the train will be shut down for a good long time. So please do not pull that cord unless you have an actual medical emergency. Well, howdy, everybody. Well, let's try this. Happy New Year. That sounds great. This is your conductor, Joe, here on the back. I want to be the first to welcome you aboard the Frisco Silver Dollar Sing-Along Train. How did for your safety, everybody, please remain seated. Keep your arms and legs inside the train at all times. I've been on the left-hand side of the train as we leave the depot. It's our new Winter Wonderland for kids. It's over there at Half Dollar Holler. Now, it's geared for kids ages 3 to 7 years old. And just up the road from Half Dollar Holler, it's Bears at the Holler and Becca's Weaving. Get in there check out all the great gift ideas they have for you. Now then, like I said, this is a sing-along train, so when I get the music started, I want everybody to sing along. Let's get in that Christmas spirit. decorations up all around town it really gets you in the Christmas spirit and I hope everybody's having a really great Christmas holiday season and you know the best thing about Christmas <laughs> that's right it's Santa Claus
Santa Claus is coming to town. Folks, we've got a very special presentation coming up for you very shortly. So at this time, we ask that if you have a cell phone or a pager, you please put them on silent for the consideration of all the folks around you. And we want to thank you. And every year we always went to my grandparents' house for Christmas dinner. And they lived way back in the woods. And by the time we got there, my grandma, she'd always be in the kitchen cooking on her old wood cook stove. She'd be making the Christmas turkey or ham and cooking up all those great pies and cakes and Christmas cookies. And grandpa, well, grandpa, he'd always be sitting there in his favorite rocking chair right beside the Christmas tree. Now, underneath the Christmas tree, There'd be all these presents scattered all around, big ones and small ones. And Grandpa, well, he'd never let us open up one single present until he sat us all down and told us all the true story of Christmas. You know, if I close my eyes, I can almost hear my Grandpa say, Well, Merry Christmas, kids. Merry Christmas. Ah, it's so good to see you. Well, Grandma and I have been expecting you. Oh, she's up there at the cabin right now, still clearing away all the mess from our Christmas morning. I love this time of year. Well, it's Christmas season still. Friends and family are coming home. People are getting together to go places. Everybody just friendlier and happier. You know, I wish we could feel that way all the time. Well, we could, you know. A long time ago, there lived a man that taught us how to feel that kind of spirit all the time. He was a special man that lived a special life, and he died a special death. Many wondrous things happened to that man, but I think the most wondrous was his birth. I'd like to tell you kids a story about the night that he was born. same country, shepherds, abiding in the fields and keeping watch over their flocks by night, when suddenly the angel of the Lord came upon them, and they were sore afraid. But the angel said, Fear not, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which shall be for all people. For unto you is born this day in the city of David a Savior who is Christ the Lord. And this shall be a sign unto you. You shall find the babe wrapped in swaddling clothes and lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of the heavenly host, praising God, saying, Glory to God in the highest. Peace 
goodwill to men. And when the angels had left them, they went and found Mary, Joseph, and the babe lying in a manger. Later, wise men came from the east, saying, Where is he who has been born King of the Jews? For we have seen his star in the east and have come to worship him. And lo, the star they had seen in the east went before them, till it came to rest over the place where the child was born. And when they saw the child, they knelt down and worshipped him, and offered gifts, gold, frankincense, myrrh. Yes, they offered many great gifts to that child, but we're the ones that have received the greatest gift, the gift of life everlasting. Isn't that a wonderful story? Well, thank you. <laughs> thank you very much. I appreciate that. Now, kids, I know that the Christmas Day has come and gone for another year, but I think the whole purpose of that story is to try to help us keep the Christmas spirit in our hearts all year long. And to help us do that, I have one more very short story for you. The greetings and carols have ended, and the glad celebrations have ceased. With the angels returning to heaven, the wise men returned to the east. But the light that once brightened a manger still shines on the world from afar. And listening hearts can still hear angels, and wise men still follow a star. Thanks for coming tonight. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Kids, I will bring that toy in on the next train. Okay. Bye-bye now. Thank you, Grandpa, for your wonderful story. And Mr. Conductor, you have a toy that I will put out here for you on the next train. And you can take it into that pretty little girl up there. Bye-bye. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Bye-bye now. Bye, Thanks for coming tonight. Bye-bye. Bye-bye now.
seeds and pass for the best price of the year with the most benefits to you. You can think about the seeds and pass office. It's located just up the road from the depot across from the greatest gift. And for the 2011 season pass holders, if you've been to five or more festivals here this year, you can also pick up your special Christmas ornament gift. safe to get off the train. And folks, be sure and check the seats around you for any valuables you might have brought on board with you. And again, please remain seated until I tell you it's safe to get off the train. And thanks again for riding. And everybody wait. 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 All right, folks, exit to your left. Have a great night. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year.